And today, six local names will be solidified in the Inland Northwest history books. Graham T's Brandon T. Jones is joining us from the Spokane Arena this morning. So Brandon, can you tell us more about this afternoon's Hall of Fame ceremony? Yes, good morning, Tim Channing. Well, you both know there is such a rich history of local sports here in the Inland Northwest. So many talented athletes, so many smart and awesome and honestly legendary coaches that have come through Spokane and the surrounding region. So today is an opportunity to go ahead and celebrate some of those individuals because not only are their families proud, but they've also made our community proud as well. So here's what you need to know. Today here at the Spokane Arena at 4 p.m., they're hosting the Inland Northwest Sports Hall of Fame ceremony in the Elysian Room. Stacy Kleinsmith, former Mead superstar and player of the year back in 1996, she's played in the WNBA and has been on the Gonzaga women's coaching staff since 2014. Sue Doring, legendary volleyball coach with 33 years of experience. Her final record at Colfax High School was 834 and 195. That's an amazing winning percentage. Isaac Fontaine, Wazoo's career leader in three-point shooting at 45.7%. Jennifer Stinson Greeny, a standout athlete in multiple sports and an award-winning volleyball coach. Dennis LaRue, known as one of the best U.S. hockey referees in the sports history and Bud Namick, a legend in the local broadcasting world. So all of these individuals will be going into the Inland Northwest Sports Hall of Fame today. So we wanna give them a big congratulations. And I also wanna say thank you for paving the way for so many others here in Spokane and the surrounding areas. But for now, reporting live here in front of the arena, Brandon T. Jones, Crimson News.